Hi, I'm Dr. Greg Castello, Board Certified Family Practice, and today we're going to talk about a new study that's making the news, and I was going to let it go, except I'm now seeing patients coming in the office asking me questions about it. And this study uh, is talking about breast cancer risk uh, being associated with taking a specific blood pressure medication called Norvasc or amlodipine. So there was a multi-year study done where they looked at high blood pressure and breast cancer and a specific drug, Norvasc or amlodipine, which is a calcium channel blocker blood pressure medication and over a 10 or more year period it appears that women who have been on this medication have a two and a half fold increased risk of developing breast cancer as opposed to the general population. Uh, a little history, we've looked at other blood pressure medicines dating back at least 25 years that I've found uh, with a drug called reserpine, uh, which is a blood pressure medicine that was also implicated in causing breast cancer. And most of the studies with most of the medications have found to have been incorrect. So part of the problem may be that some of the risk factors uh, for blood pressure, being overweight, having a high-fat diet, may be the same risk factors that make you at a greater risk of breast cancer. So having high blood pressure uh, may share a common thread with developing breast cancer, which is why some other medications have been um, indicated in the past, but so far none have been shown to cause breast cancer. Uh, a concern with the study is, is that Norvasc or amlodipine at the time of this study over that 10-year period was the most commonly prescribed antihypertensive medication in the world. So of all the women who got breast cancer who had blood pressure problems, a good chance was that they were on this Norvasc medication which may skew the data. Uh, I'm not arguing that it could or could not. At this point, I don't have a clear answer as to whether Norvasc increases your risk of blood pressure. I will tell you that the, some of the same risk factors for blood pressure are the same risk factors for breast cancer. So that may be the association. But there's a very simple answer for this right now. Um, Norvasc is a generic drug. There are many other generic drugs very similar to Norvasc. So if you have a concern or you've got a family history of breast cancer, it would be reasonable to ask your doctor to switch you to a different blood pressure medication. So this is different than what I've told people in the past with other studies and other medications with drugs that are excellent drugs. They have very specific uses and are very beneficial. Uh, I'm definitely not in love with Norvasc or calcium channel blockers. Uh, there's many other classes of drugs that do an excellent job as well, and there would be no problem if you switched your blood pressure medication to a different one. Don't stop your blood pressure medication until you talk to your doctor. Um, if you do get switched to a different class of drugs, they're going to have to start over and may have to see you back early and recheck your blood pressure on the new medications. They may do follow a blood work on the new medications. Um, and there are a couple of specific indications for Norvasc with heart issues uh, that you may want to stay on that medication. But for right now, uh, the current thought is, is that Norvasc has been associated with an increased risk of breast cancer. Uh, uh, true or not, I can't tell you, but easy enough to switch you to a different medication under the advice of your doctor. Don't do it yourself. Dr. Greg Castello, thanks.